everyone, this is Julia from Green Umbrella and today I wanted to show you this tool that enables you to search um, online to find somebody's email uh, address. So if you know the person's name or if you know what company they're from, it's a great way of finding emails. Okay, so it's called hunter.io and now if I go and search for a company, so let's have a look. The one I've been using is uh, HRC Law, uh, which are a law company based up in Manchester. So if I go onto HRC Law, you can go onto anybody's website address. You just take the website address, copy it, and whiz it into good old Hunter. You see where it just says here, the company name, and I click here and find email addresses. And what it will do is it'll actually look, uh, not just through the HRC's website, but it'll actually look into other websites as well. You see over here where it says 12 sources. So if I click here, and actually tell me that that is Simon's email address and it will tell me all the other places you know, equipment supermarket NPL worldwide it's obviously found it on the HRC law website as well uh, and jobs at team website so it's clarified and it's given it a green tick because not only is it just found it on one site it's found it on lots of other websites as well the other good thing about this is it actually gives you the pattern so I know that HRC, HRC laws um, website is actually you know first name last name name with no dots at hrclaw.co.uk if I have a look at some of the other people's Carol Parker at HRC Law. do you see what I mean you can see actually see the pattern in which um, you can email people so if you know the person's name you've got a good idea of what their email address is so that's the first one I wanted to show you but the thing that I think is really quite sexy about this is the integration with LinkedIn so if I go on to LinkedIn Okay, and I do a search for, um, let's do a search for Harry Cooper. I have no idea who Harry Cooper is, that's just a name that's just come into my head. Okay, so I'm going to click on this one, only because he's a third person, if you can see he's a third connection. Okay, he's a nice fella. <laughs> uh, he's working at this company called Accenture. Okay. So he's a third connection, so if I can't get his email address, the only way I can connect with him is actually click the connect button. And I really don't want to do that because he doesn't know me, therefore he's probably going to say I don't know this person and reject my connection request. So what I can do is warm up that conversation first just by emailing him direct. So with Hunter, you see you've got a little fox just up here in the top right hand corner, if I click that little fox. There you go, it's given me his email address. And again, it says it's 97% confident of that because it's actually not just searched um, his LinkedIn profile, it will search other places just to make sure that that is the actual proper email address. So that's what it's saying. And I haven't actually had any of these come back that are wrong yet with that high percentage. So um, it's like a waving a little bit of magic over LinkedIn. So check that one out. It's called hunter.io. And if you want to find somebody's email address, it is completely free of charge. Let me just show you the, the pricing structure on here. Actually, if I log out, Um, and you can see the price in here. Okay, so it's completely free of charge up to 150 emails a month. Okay, uh, if you wanted to start growing databases and that sort of thing, obviously you then have to pay for it, but you're scraping the internet, but it is really, really reliable. Uh, previous to this, I was using Refer Yes, which some of you may have heard me talk about before, um, but then it started throwing back some, you know, pretty naff results and the email addresses weren't working. So this one is spot on. So I recognize that, Rec I recommend that one. That's called hunter.io. All right, let me sign out for another week. I'll see you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.